Hello guys, so welcome to KO Tutorials. So let's continue with the next part of this tutorial. So let's get started. So as you can see over here, we have started with the car modeling over here. So let's continue it. So now what I'll be doing over here is like, as you can see over here, we have something left over here to do with this part. So I'll just go over here. So this part. So if you see this, let's just zoom this over here, okay. So I'll just select this edge, just select this edge and let's extrude it a bit inside in this way. Select the vertices, right click and weld it so let's just do this stuff over here and now again drag it over here so we can just make sure that this is correctly adjusted target weld with this like this over here so now if you go over here and see this it's going to be much smoother now Now, I'll just go into this polygons I can just select this and Let's give a target weld right over here. So you can just adjust this a bit in this way. And now I can just select this part and I can slightly just push it inside select this weld it and, and push it inside right click Weld it and uh, stop it. You can see this? So we can make such stuff over here in this way. So if I'm doing generating such details, then you have to go with this things over here correctly. So now what I can do over here is like as you can see, if you want, I can just select this. So let's select these edges. This. And let's bridge it. So you can easily bridge this. And if you want, I can just go over here, I can just put one loop over here. So let's just bridge it again. So select this edges, select this edges, select this and this and let's bridge it. Select this and this 
let's just bridge it and now I'll just put one loop over here one over here so like this and let's bridge it so we can do such uh, bridging stuff over here so we can just close this area as required so that is possible over here now after that once you're done with this let's again go over here let's go to the side view and we have some details over here so let's put some loops over here so I'll just place some loops right away over here let's select this edges and let's just bridge it in this way now that looks okay now so you can put at least two loops over here now let's again go back over here so a few things are left which needs to be done so let's just select this extrude it drag it over here weld it go to the top view again just shuffle it in this way again select this edges over here drag it in this way so instead of dragging it in this way I can just select this and let's weld it alright so again go over here so if you have a back view that would be much easy for you to work over here so for now I'll just take this if you want I can just extrude it directly so I'll just put one loop over here right now so I can just shuffle this select this extrude it over here go to this view drag it over here in this way so let's put one loop push it over here in this way drag it up so we need to adjust it correctly so just slightly push it inside in this way so just save your file select this again extrude it drag it in this way so we need to adjust it correctly over here to match it so again select this again weld it take a take a swift loop let's right click and let's give a cut over here select the vertices weld it again give no toggle 
So you can just assign this. Again, go over here, slightly just push it inside. Oops. So we have to weld this. So let's just weld it over here. Alright, again select the edges. Drag it. So if you see this, uh, it's definitely going to show like this over here. But that's the outer part. So that's totally okay. So we can just push it in this way as you require it so when you're doing such details it takes time so definitely we have to make sure we do it correctly over here front also will manage it perfectly so again so just adjust it properly all right so again go over here as you can see, let's again put one loop over here. So this is for your light section. Definitely will will do the adjustment for the lights also. So I'll slightly just shuffle it up. right click and just weld it again just drag it over here select the vertices again weld it select the edges drag it out, weld it, push it over here. So as you can see, uh, we have tried to manage this stuff correctly. So just keep on adjusting the vertices in the right manner. push it inside all right so guys if any doubts please put it in the comment section over here so as you can see we are almost into the completion for this then we'll be going with some of the detailing stuff so please like and subscribe my youtube channel so we'll continue the rest of the part in the coming tutorial so thanks for watching this tutorial